Footballers, here is how you can continue to do your speed training while you are still in season. The things we need to focus on, just like the last point, we need to keep them short because longer sprints are more fatiguing. There's nothing more stressful on the body than top speed sprinting. So ideally, I like to keep things really short during the season, like 10 to 15 yards and repeating that is perfect. The other thing we can start to talk about is these things called soft starts. So when you're doing your sprint training, you have soft starts and hard starts. Hard starts are going to require more force output to get you going. So we tend to use soft starts in our programs because that is just a way for us to still get your sprint training in while still limiting the amount of fatigue that is placed on the body. So soft starts are things like a walking start. Soft starts are things like a split stance start and a light falling start.